Listen, one of the main relationship killers is the need to always be right. You know how when you're having an argument or a disagreement with your mate and you try to prove that the other person is wrong? Now, there's nothing wrong with defending yourself and there's certainly nothing wrong with stating your case. But what's the condition of your heart when you do it? Are you the type that can't let it go until the other person see things your way? Or are you the one that Google all the statistics, the facts, the proofs and exhibits of the evidence as if you're a defense attorney? Because it's not a court of law. We're talking about a healthy relationship here. Don't be that person that always tries to prove you're right. The reason why you do it could possibly be rooted in the fact that you grew up feeling criticized, misunderstood, or not secure enough in your own identity. You may think you are the rational and sensible one, and you're trying to justify yourself making yourself look good, but it's not a good look. As a matter of fact, it makes you look bad, and it makes your significant other feel insignificant. It shows you have a low emotional intelligence, and that's a whole nother topic I don't have time to unpack right now. But think about it. What does the need to be right do for you? What do you get out of it? What is your intention when you try to prove yourself right? I believe it's a heart matter. Relationships are about compromise and gaining an understanding of each other's perspectives to draw you closer, not drive a wedge in your connection with your partner. It's okay to have an argument. You and your spouse are not always going to agree. It's okay to agree to disagree at times, to keep the peace. You don't have it all and you're not perfect, but the main goal should be to listen to each other and work together to understand each other's way of looking at things. Just be vulnerable, have compassion for each other. That way you both win. Now that's relationship goals.